Hello YouTubers, hello everyone and welcome to Games Video. I'm your host and today I'm just going to show you something really ex exceptional, something really nice and uh, and I was just uh, thinking about helping out, you know, making this tutorial. I don't, I don't usually do tutorials but um, I thought it was really helpful because um, so many people are having some problem, you know, and, um, and I'm really glad you not know, to really share this with you. Um, but before we get started, I just want to say, before, uh, first of all, you need to have four things. You need to have all these files. Uh, and uh, first, you know, of course, you need to have your game. And you need to have three particular files. I mean, the first one is, of course, you need to have the main patch. And after that, you need to have uh, another patch, an additional patch called um, a switch. And, um, and then after that, you need to have the uh, HXD files. Okay, that's optional. Okay, now the first thing you need to do is to, um, after you extract the files, because I'm going to leave the link in, in the description, so for you guys not to uh, uh, extract, I mean, uh, all the files in order to get this folder. So once you have that, okay, you just open it, and the first thing you get is two particular um, files inside. And what you need to do is, the first thing you need to do is to, uh, to download uh, actually install the uh, DLC 4.0 ins installer you need to install that okay then when when you install that okay I'm just gonna show you right quick go to admin okay and then you just keep going and uh, install this all the way to the end next 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 and you stop and then when it says finish okay you go to the second one the second one is the actual patch the uh, patch 4.0 install okay the same thing you install that okay it's pretty much the same thing you know I have that already and uh, you just install this all the way to the end okay next 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 all the way to the end okay all right now once everything is done okay you go back to your file to your main uh, files and and the next thing you want to do is to install also the uh, uh, basically the uh, the switch the um, switch fix okay just open it like this and then you get two files like this okay once you get that all you have to do is just to copy I mean uh, the uh, galaxy switch and uh, like I said you copy it and then you go back to your file directory inside your game you know um, pretty much if you install games before you know what I'm talking about you just go in but the shortest way is to um, basically right click on the game and go to open file location which is the shortest way to get to your file directory and then you, once you get here all you have to do is just to basically right click and install basically right click and paste okay you paste and you just paste your your the uh, galaxy switch okay and once you once you basically uh, cut I mean replace it Okay, the next thing you want, last thing, which is, last thing you want to do is just to um, uh, double click on the, uh, um, on the uh, Galaxy Switch, not the, not the game, not the main file, you know, but the, the Galaxy Switch. Okay, you just double click on that, like that, and then you can go to General, you go to each tab, you know, to see if you want to make any changes, okay, before you, I mean, um, start your game. And then you go to, uh, um, okay, oh, and uh, the, the most important thing in this installation is this, is where it says, like, the, uh, this is why you install the actual patch, I mean, switch fix, is to make sure that you set this up to no stream executable. It has to be set up that way, because otherwise the game won't work. So you just install it that way. Okay, and then you can go just uh, uh, check mark all these things if those are optional, you don't have to. Okay, and then you go to visuals, go to um, if you want to change, I mean, uh, your, your logos to some glossy logos, you can click on that to enable it, and uh, so on and so on. If you want to change and make some changes on, on, the, on the skins, you can do so, you can change that. Same thing to uh, uh, fruit graphic mode you can do the same thing as long as you understand what you're doing everything should be fine okay and um, the crowd if you want to make uh, your crowd more uh, fancy looking things like that okay 
that this would work you just click and you, you would automatically be successful by you know um, click on, on each button and then you go to divisions okay division is basically is it's also optional I mean uh, what it is is just if you want to leave it as a default or if you want the uh, um, Buddha's Linga I mean Buddha's Liga is uh, basically um, those are optional uh, uh, leagues okay I mean but if you want that that's fine I prefer that I mean that's why I just have it okay and then you click on changes and it will change automatically now the last thing is like uh, these are the files that you have inside your the uh, DP uh, DP files list and uh, and I'll show you in a minute what it looks like but these are option optional uh, files that you want to add into your game so um, as long as you understand this um, the switch then you should be able to add each things that are missing or things like that okay so that's pretty much it okay and then if you when you're ready to start the game you just uh, please start and your game should start automatically I mean just as simple as that okay now um the last thing I wanted to mention also is to um, is also the uh, about this file here this file called hxd what it is is just for you to basically keep track of all your I mean all your basically elements that you have inside your game okay uh, I'm just gonna show you how it works you know I mean if you want something extra something really fancy or something you know this is the, the best tool for you to install okay and then uh, all you have to do is just to uh, go to um, file open and then 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 this will automatically open your download inside your your game your download folder and then you'll see a a, um, a DP file list just like I mentioned before all you have to do is just to basically click this because you won't get the backup automatically it says once you save it then you get a backup so um, or unless you install something before you know but I'm sure you you have a backup but what you need to focus on is the new domain um, basically the new file the new uh, bin file which is here and then go to open just open and basically you get all this you know basically to confirm that you have um, all your galaxy uh, file install inside your game now if everything is missing you can add you, get, you can just keep adding I mean um, if you can do it manually you can do it so so that's pretty much it okay um, this is the best way to install the game but most importantly you don't have to worry about this as long as you have everything else I mean install so that's pretty much it and this wraps up the end of this video thanks for watching and if you have any questions just feel free um, to leave me a comment uh, please uh, subscribe to my channel uh, like my video and uh, and again I'll be more than welcome to help out I mean uh, if there's anything I can, I can do for you guys thanks a lot for watching and you have a good one bye bye